I'm standing tall. Got too many spots and I rock them all. Cause I'm a cowboy on this main ride. It's one hit, I'm not dead, I'm on my lock, not I'm calling it. It's gonna be a good day. We're gonna catch some redfish. We're gonna use them game changers. We're gonna use them with them outlaw rods. I have some out an, a new outlaw rod that I just made. I'm testing out, so I'm hoping it's gonna put some fish on for you guys and you can see what it's all about. So let's go check it out. All right, guys, I'm gonna try out my newest rod I just built today, or the other day. It is a seven foot medium mod fast rod. It says Matthew 419, which means what Jesus says, follow me and I will make you the fishers of men. And I give him all the glory and I thank God for, for such a, wonderful day that i can fish in and all the opportunities i have to do this kind of stuff so i've got the uh i've got the cr game changer crankbait ready to go with this new medium rod i built for outlaw rods so let's see if i can put this into action and see what's up okay able to get good cast in this morning the wind's not preventing me from having bad cast so I'm able to get closer to these rocks like I like on my first attempt since I've started this morning. I'm feeling the game changer hitting the bottom, bouncing off the bottom. Make it, look at that, it looks beautiful. It looks really good. Good action. I've, the rod feels good, I can feel it. I can feel the, the action of the crankbait. Now all I need to do is fill a good hook set. And I'm good to go right there, baby. Already. Nice. Let's see what I got going on here. What do I got? Oh, nice. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. That thing, I don't know. That might be close. We'll see what it does here. Not bad. Third cast, third cast on this morning and uh the rod felt good man that rod felt really good let's, let's let's get this bad boy unhooked and let's get it measured let's hopefully it's a keep that's a good sign already let's get this bad boy pay to go hooked up pretty good here ah, these hooks are really good all right nice fish here nice fish let's see what we got oh six, 16 17 17 18 yeah we're keep okay stop stop i'll let you play with it in a minute baby girl we definitely have a keep so right on man beautiful redfish let me get the live well going i should have last time i pays it go last time i got the live well going too early and it jinxed me so this time i'm good to go all right i'm a little closer than than i really need to i see bait running all through here which is a good sign 
But I'm a little close. I'm like right on the edge of these rocks over here. <laughs> I probably should have be a little bit further out, which I'm going to try to do. That way I'm not that close. All you got to do is get that rod out further this way. That way you feel like you're closer towards the rocks. I guess I'll have some fish tacos tonight. See, hung up a little bit. I'm just not gonna force it. Sometimes it lets itself go. I'm just gonna pop it just light, ever so lightly. Still not free. Yep, it's freed, see? So you, you force it and you go too hard, you're just gonna stay hung up. These crank, these game changers will end up floating. These crankbaits or whatever. Oh, there's a fish that just rolled right in front of me. I don't know what it was. But let's just see what that was. Maybe I can get on something right here. Maybe it was just a big mullet or something, but... Nope, nothing. I couldn't get that lucky while I had the camera rolling. Man, making some great gas this morning. For sure. Like every cast like that, I'm like, man, that's money, dude. There's got to be a fish. And, oh, like I said, when you say you think it's a good cast, it's not a keep, but that's okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. I will take it. Look at that. I barely got that sucker. I mean, barely. <sighs> Little rat. All right. Hey, you'd like to you'd like that little game chamber changer, buddy. That's good. Okay. Now you can see it. You like it? You like it? Okay. All right. All right, it's pretty early. I was saying that last cast was a good one. It felt like a, a good one to catch a fish and I caught one, it was pretty cool. But uh, I worked nights last night and uh, just wanted to make a little quick trip this morning for a couple hours and catch a few fish and do a little bit of filming. And uh, it's already a successful trip for a short trip I'm gonna do to have a all right, you know, fishing the boat already this early. But we'll just see how tired I am after working nights last night, a 12 hour shift. But, uh, oh, I thought I, it was a, it was a rock. <laughs> but yeah, that felt good. But yeah, we'll just see how tired I get, but I'm hoping I can get on some, some bigger hookups for you guys. All right, I'm gonna change colors. I'm gonna go to a red crawfish color. I always do pretty good with these two. Pretty, pretty successful. Like a Texas jalapeno. Look at it, it's already all been ate up, but they hold up really nice. Oh man, what another great cast. This rod feels good. You can just feel it bouncing off the bottom. Oh, there we go. That's what I needed right there. That's what I needed. Another little rat. Look at that. See, you gotta be careful guys when, when you're in the channel, like the, the coming around the channel these big waves come. So I'm gonna get out here a little ways so it don't push me on the rocks. Let me get this in. 
Right in the time I catch a fish, it wants to do this. Make sure I'm dug in good. Put the fish in the boat. Oh, that's gonna be a big wave right there, bro. Holy cow. Hang on, Paisley. This is a big one. Woo! Yeah, that's a big one right there. You gotta be ready for these. If you're not ready for these, you're going into the rocks. What are the odds of me catching a fish right at the time these big waves come? So we got to the end of this run over here along the rocks. I got a hold of one slot and uh, two rat reds. It's, it's, it's still pretty early, but it's, it's warming up. That cool front hadn't hit yet. So me and Paisley, we're gonna go on a cool run, try to find another spot, see if we can get on some reds fish and then go home and take a nap. <clears throat> All right, I see some birds out here working. Hopefully it's not on some gaff top or whatever. Hopefully it's either trout or redfish. We'll see. And get in there nice and easy and throw right into there. So this rod right here is my uh, medium heavy seven foot rod. It's balanced really nice. We'll see what's under these birds and let this rod do some work. Should be, oh, got a hit. Okay, nice. We'll see what this is. Probably better not be a gaff top. I bet it is. Don't be a gaff top. Yep, gaff, gaff top. Dang it. That's all right. Got my gaff top grip. Watch out, Pace. That's a good size gaff top, though, but it's not what I'm looking for today. Come on. Mm -mm. Come on, get off. Good size gaff top right there. Dang. There we go. He's off. I'm gonna do another cast. Hopefully there's trout in there too. Right there, right in there. There we go. All right, fish on. I don't know what I got. Is it a big ugly? Yep, big ugly. Dang, that sucks. Big ugly. Paisley wants it though. I'll cast a few more times and see if I can't see if there's any trout in there. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> okay, guys, I had a great time. Um, I'm cutting it early. It rain's about to set in. Uh, I worked last night too, so. I got on some gaff top under the birds. I got a, a slot redfish and some, some rat reds. Did get on some fish and uh, I'm just gonna call it a day. I'm gonna try it again tomorrow when the, the rain's not gonna be in. Hopefully it's gonna be a little cooler. But uh, anyway, I had a blast and as always, tight lines and God bless. And I'm a cowboy, don't miss me, I can ride. It's wanted, I'm not dead. I'm alive, not dead, we will survive. I'm standing.
and talk. Got too many spots and I rock them all.